hello, Grumpy Goblin here. And I had just logged in to find out that I'm down to $8 million, meaning that uh, I have sold a buttload of stuff, or I bought, I always say sold when I mean buy. I'm down to $8 million, down from uh, uh, 16 or 15 or what it was the other day, which means I have bought a buttload of stuff that I need to get smelting. I've bought a tons of gold ore. Um, I've done this several times. I've got almost a full chest, double chest of diamonds. I've got several emeralds. Uh, look at the gold ore. That was full when I checked in. Look at all these gold ingots that I need to get into bought into uh, blocks. Uh, yeah, so in order to get caught up, I had to kind of close the door to the shop. I've got gold smelting all over the place. Um, I'm up to 121 tickets. Uh, today, my goal, and my only goal today, is to get up to 500 tickets and make a trip to the commissary to sell off this as much as I can in this chest, which you can see is a ton of diamond blocks. Uh, that's where most of the money is tied up tied up at right now. Uh, so, yeah. So, uh, I'm not going to make you watch my boring uh, stuff. And that's all iron blocks. Um... I'm getting I'm getting way too much iron. Um, uh, I mean I mean that's good, but the thing is is that because it's cheap and it builds up so fast, uh, I can make a lot per per uh, block, and I make quite a bit per block, um, like fifty something per ore. You know I make thirty thousand or so uh, per block, or three thousand, and um, I get a ton. <laughs> Uh, a ton of iron in, but it just takes so long to build up to 500 tickets that it's just uh, sapping all of my, my free time uh, in the game. I have no time. All I do is mine, and I don't mind it, but um, I'd rather not have to mine 500 tickets every single day. Um, so, yeah, so that's that. Um, people are begging to open. I will open in a minute. Uh, so anyways, I'm going to keep on organizing and uh, doing this. So I'm going to go ahead and open up the shop to the flood. Um, but yeah, that guy took three of my four blocks that I just undid. And he, will he give him back? Will he give him back? Hey, baseball 7530. You going to give me back? Give me back the, the wood you just accidentally picked up? He might not have noticed. So anyway, um, come on in. There we go. All right, so I'm not going to make you watch my boring sorting and, and making things into block and, and all that kind of fun stuff. Um, when I'm when I go to mine, I'm going to do a speed run uh, up to four 500 tickets, so you can actually see. Um, get out, dude! All right. Anyway, so you can actually see me go from 121 tickets up to 500 that'll that might just be mainly that might be uh, extremely boring too so i might not even record that uh so anyway i've got a lot of boring stuff to do over the next 25 minutes 35 minutes probably actually might be close to an hour there's enough stuff in here that needs to smelt um so yeah fine you're gonna stay in there i'm gonna lock you in bye all right i'll be back in a little bit bye hello i am back um it's been a little while. I kind of uh, took a break, got offline for a little bit, went outside. It was like 65 degrees out, or 60 degrees, 65 degrees or so. Needed to get outside, get some fresh air. Um, don't neglect the outdoors, even though we're on the computers a lot. Uh, it's good to get outside every once in a while, uh, just to get some fresh air and to remember what it's like to actually like move your legs and stuff like that. So... Yeah, so I took a little bit of a break today, um, but I'm back on, and I uh, kind of got lucky when I got on. Uh, I was going to uh, mine up to f up to 500 tickets. When I got on, I was like at 255 or something like that, and uh, I put an ad in the chat um, buying uh, C3 tickets for 125,000 because I'm just not into mining today. I don't know. I just did not feel like it. Um, I did not feel like running around the mines uh, for hours on end um, to get up to 500 tickets. Uh, so I put an ad out and I said, hey, I'll pay anybody 
uh, if they'll just, you know, <laughs> sell me their C3 ticket. And a uh, shout out to Master Blee. I think he's still online. Um, it might not show up in that list there because there's quite a few people online right now. But Master Blee, thank you so much. Um, uh, we met here in my cell. And uh, I wasn't ready to record to get the actual sale, but uh, shout out to Master Blee. Thank you so much for uh, for selling me your C3 ticket. Um, I paid him $125,000. I was going to pay him $40,000 up front, and then $85,000, oh, and then $80,000 uh, if it was a C3 ticket. Because I, re I really wish that they would make the ticket slightly, you know, retexture them and use a different item for each one. Uh, maybe a book for C2 or and an enchanted book or something like that for C3 so that we could visibly tell the difference between each of the different um, tickets. But they all look the same. They all look like a little white piece of paper in your hand. So you don't know if, there's, if they're holding a C1, C2, or C3 ticket. So I offered him uh, 40000 up front and 85000 uh, if it was a C3 ticket. Uh, at the very least, I'd be out of forty thousand dollars, which you know doesn't take me long to make back. Um, but he just tossed me the ticket. Uh, didn't didn't wait for my uh, down payment, so to speak. It was a C3, uh, so I paid him the hundred and twenty-five thousand, and then I gave him an, an additional twenty-five thousand. So I paid him a hundred and fifty thousand dollars for one C3 ticket, uh, which was a pretty good uh, pretty good on his part. Uh, that's a pretty good profit. He immediately went and ranked up and was really excited about that, so awesome. Um, I, I like being able to to help people out, give them some money, because uh, he worked hard for those 500 tickets, and uh, he just got well paid for those 500 tickets, $150,000. There was another person advertising on the server around the same time, offering 60000 for C3 tickets, and... Um, I, I just paid someone ninety thousand more than that. So, if you ever catch me on, <clears throat> if you ever catch me uh, on the server and you've got a C3 ticket or you've got five hundred tickets built up, I will buy your C3 ticket. Uh, going rate, I pay one hundred and twenty-five thousand um, dollars. And and um, if you tell me that you're a listener of the uh, of the, uh, if you're a subscriber and you, you watch my videos, then I'll pay you 150000 for those C3 tickets. I will, I will match the deal that I gave Master Blee today. So if you've got a C3 ticket, uh, catch me online, prison number three, and I will buy them from you for 150000 And uh, I do ask that you toss it into a hopper first so that I can verify that it is a C3 ticket or toss it to me. Um... Just uh, if you meet me, uh, what we'll do is we'll meet in my shop and we'll wait for it to clear out. And then I block the door so that no one can get in or grab anything tossed around. And then we'll do the transaction. Uh, we'll do the deed. Well, not 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 that deed, but the, the, the deed of, you know. the Anyway. Um, all right. So I'm going to be heading into the C3 shop here soon. Oh, yeah. Here's the ticket right there. C3, temporary access to C3 shop. 500 tickets. Uh, I'm going to be clearing out my inventory here. Um, let's get everything out here. I don't have enough room in there for the go. Um, okay. Okay. Interesting. All right. Let's just pop back in here. Hopefully none of my stuff is on the floor back here. I uh, shouldn't because I was in a chest. There we go. Uh, let's throw all this in here. Let's take these diamonds. I'm going to go ahead and... Whoops. I don't have enough emeralds for a stack. All right. Give me a couple minutes here. I'm going to go ahead and sort through my inventory, figure out what I got, and then I'll come back in. Uh, I'll, I'll start recording again, and then uh, you can visit visit me uh, come with me as my visit to the C3 commissary. All right? I will be right back. BRB, as they say. All right. Be right back. All right. I am back. And uh, it looks like all the furnaces are done. So let's go ahead and empty them. And then we will 
make some blocks of everything that we've got and uh, head over to the C3 shop. C3 commissary. Let's get everything here. Gold. 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 Let's throw this in here really quick. Let's split this up into four so it goes a little faster. I found uh, I found a stack of gold in one of my chests. Every every little bit of gold helps. All right, all right. Let's go back here. <clears throat> so the reason that I think I explained or I I didn't finish explaining was that um, or I did finish, but uh, I think I left off. I was talking about how the uh, I built this here. The in case I ever get logged off by the pro oh nuts. If I ever get logged off by the proxy or, you know, lose my internet connection or whatever, all of my stuff will get thrown to the ground in this little room back here. Um, and hopefully I'll be able to get logged back in before uh, before it despawns or before the the lag cleaner comes by and, and gets rid of it. Screwed that one up. Alright, let's go. Here we go. Boom. 14. And now 21. Boom, and we'll take this. And there we go. Let's go ahead and do the emeralds. 21. Exciting, thrilling footage. But this is what it's like to make stacks or blocks. And, and then stacks of blocks. Sure helps you not use up all the information or all the space in your uh, inventory. Alright, let's get rid of some of this stuff. I don't need the pillars or the torches or the sandstone. Uh, I don't need the sticks or the signs or this iron ore. Although I will go ahead and throw this iron ore in here so it'll be done when I get back. Uh, let's put my... Oh look, more ingots. Um... Let's go ahead and just get them out of the way. <clears throat> get everything into blocks that I possibly can. Save inventory space. Um, I'm not sure how much I'm going to make on this trip. Um, I'd like to make six million, but I think that's going to be pushing it since there's going to be a lot of iron in this trip. Um, I'd like to I'd like to go over twenty million, but I'm realistic. Realistic in thinking that that's probably not going to happen. Probably not going to get over 20 million on this trip. And that'll be fine. Yeah, I don't think that's going to happen. Uh, alright. Um, see, iron ingots go in here. I said I was going to take care of all inventory, so let's go ahead and block these. Oh, for a shift, a shift. If I could just hold shift and these pop up here and, and split up automatically, that would be awesome. But the Minecraft deities say nay. Uh, maybe someday. I don't know. All right, six is not enough, so there we go. Um, I'll take those. Thank you. Um, let's throw them in here. All right, so let's go over here, and I will throw my precious picks <clears throat> in the bottom row of this chest. Moneymaker's getting low. Moneymaker 2's getting low. Going to have to work on it. I could start using Moneymaker. It's an efficiency 5, um, so it, it really just rips through anything. Um, All right, this gold is done. And there's another full stack of gold. How much did I put out here? None. Or none. All right. All right, I think I'm done. <clears throat> um, all right, let's go ahead and load up. The uh, emeralds are definitely going with us. 
diamonds are definitely going with us. And then as much gold as I can get is definitely going with us. Leave a sp space there for the ticket. Alright, so I'm going to fill up the rest with iron. And that looks like all we're going to get right there. That's going to be our trip. Um, I'm optimistic about selling it all again. I had a lot of time left over, but I'm going to have to go to three different signs. Four different signs. Emerald and then jump over to diamonds, and then cross the room to gold, and then to iron. Um, but I'll run out in iron. Uh, if I don't get everything sold in the two minutes that I'm going to be there, it's going to happen during the iron, which which is fine. Uh, I've been thinking about putting the iron blocks up for sale. Because <clears throat> look at look at this. Look at that. I've been putting. I've been thinking about putting the iron blocks up for sale um, at a break even, calculating out. And selling it by the block, uh, or at least by the stacks. Um, I'd probably sell it by the stacks, um, and just put it at a break-even price, so I can get some of that money back. Because um, it's just too many trips, too many trips to the to the commissary. So let's head that way. Oh, um, <clears throat> okay, that's fine. I'll just buy a, I'll just break it by hand, or I'll buy a stone pick. Whoops. I'll buy a stone pick or something from the shop when I come back because I'm going to be locked. Whoops! I'm going to be locked out of my <laughs> locked out of my cell when I come back because I don't have a pick on me. All right. Now, if you remember, I had 501 tickets, and you're wondering how do you get 503? Well, I got two tickets when I broke the uh, <laughs> two tickets when I broke the sandstone to get back into my cell earlier. Um, I broke broke one, and then I got two tickets on the second the second block. So I got from 501 to 503 just by getting into my cell. All right, so here's what we're going to sell. Currently at 14, 14, uh, let's see, where's my pen? At 14 million, 6,146. Right, 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 basically 14 million. Four, six. All right, so <clears throat> game plan. Most valuable is emeralds, then second is diamond, third is gold, and last, whatever time I've got left in there, I'll go and try to sell off the iron. So, I'm going to hit this sign, and then I'm going to hit this sign, and then I'm going to run to my right and hit that sign that you can kind of see right there. And then I'm going to turn around and run over here and hit this sign right here. So I'm going to go right, left, Right, left. Got that? I'm going to go right, left, right, left. Um, you know what? I need the ticket. <laughs> so let's go back here to uh, Mr. Commissary Man. Hello, Mr. Commissary. I will take one of these uh, C3 tickets, please. Thank you very much. <clears throat> I have three tickets again. It is so disheartening and uh, exciting at the same time to see... My ticket's down to that low of a number, three. All right, left, right, left. I mean, right, left, right, left. Are you ready? <clears throat> Oops. I said, are you ready? I'm ready. <laughs> All right. Okay. Whew. 14 million. 6,146. And we go. I missed. Here we go. All right. I'm going to hit this first. These should sell pretty quick because I don't have that many. And then I'm just going to turn, hit diamond blocks. So I'm going to go right, left, right, left. So as soon as the diamond, as soon as chat says I don't have any more of these, I'm going to quickly turn to my right and run over there to the gold block sign. <clears throat> 95 seconds remaining. 93 out of items. Run to the gold block. 87 seconds. Had had a little bit of gold in my inventory this time, so we'll. This might take a little while. 80 seconds remaining. As soon as this says I am out of those items, I'm going to do an about face. Quickly run across the room and then spam the iron block sign. Again, I will not be checking my inventory because. It can uh, cause a delay. 
1800 per gold block. They're still going. 52 seconds remaining. At least I hope they're still going. No one's said anything in chat for a while. I can only assume that it's working. <laughs> I sure hope it is. No one has said anything. Like 30 seconds. I have 30 seconds left. Come on, I gotta be out of gold block soon. Oh yeah, it's still going. Oh no! No, 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 no. I am back. I am back. And I didn't get to sell any of this iron. <clears throat> oh well. Um, I got up to 17.9 million. That, uh... That stinks, man. Um, <laughs> that just stinks um it happens there's nothing i can do about it um from experience asking for any kind of um preparations or you know replacements from the admins or the helpers that you know there's nothing they're going to do about it um even though i got it on video it was quite obvious that uh that was that that just sucked so anyway <laughs> i am i am glad that i got through all of the emeralds and all of the diamonds and all of the gold uh at least it kicked me off right as i was getting into the iron in fact i hadn't even started the iron because these are all exactly full stacks if you go back and watch the video i had not hit the the iron sign yet so that really sucked yeah, let's calculate up. I'm kind of curious what that cost me. Uh, let's see, those are, I mean, not a whole lot. Uh, it really wasn't that big of a loss because I was just down to the iron. Um, so we've got uh, seven stacks here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, seven stacks at, um, yeah, like I said, it wasn't that much. I mean, it wasn't that Ah, oh, big of a loss. I mean, yeah, I mean, it was. So, so all right, so each, <clears throat> let's do the math. I, I'm kind of still, st I'm st stammering because I, that's the first time that that has happened to me on camera. Kind of frustrating, but anyway. All right, so uh, each stack, or each each block of iron is worth, uh, what do they buy it at, 1,008? So uh, each block each stack of blocks is worth sixty-four thousand five hundred and twelve dollars. Sixty-four thousand five hundred and twelve. I had seven of those, so that was a loss of four thousand. Oh, sorry, four hundred fifty-one thousand five hundred eighty-four. Uh, if I had been able to sell that to the store, my total would have been 18434650 But hey, uh, <clears throat> you win some, you lose some. In that case, I lost some. Uh, <laughs> anywho, 17.9 million. Um, 17.9 million. Not too bad. Um, I am, uh, I'm going to be releasing another video tonight uh here in about uh shortly after this one um i'm gonna be looking at the spreadsheet that i posted in the last episode that showed the rank up levels and the costs and everything um scouty derpy is asking when my cell is opening <clears throat> probably about an hour maybe two um, yeah, so 
17.9. So, um, but it's it's gonna it's gonna show you why. I right, what you doing, by the way? I am recording and getting ready to edit. Um, <clears throat> people ask me several times a day, uh, why don't I rank up? And so I'm gonna make a video that uh, that shows exactly why I'm why I'm waiting to rank up. Um, I've kind of said uh, in my first video one of the reasons I don't rank up is because of my cell location and I do not want to lose this uh, primo location. Um, but it goes a little bit deeper than that. Uh, it, it's it's the location and I need to save up a certain amount of money so that I can make a move up, 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 up. So, um, yep. Yeah. So anyways, um, <clears throat> pay my rent. All right. Um, thanks for watching this video. Um, I, I've cut and I've stopped and started so many times. I don't even know how long it is. So my apologies if it run a little long. Um, but again, thanks for watching. If you learned anything, if you enjoyed anything, go ahead and hit that like button. Um, subscribe to the channel if you're not already. Um, I do almost exclusively Minecraft videos, but I also do some other stuff. If the mood should hit me, I've done some goat simulator, things like that. Um, so anyway, thanks for watching and, uh, may the proxy never kick you. Until we meet again. Alrighty, bye-bye.